your road back, right? And I'm five. And keep in mind, I wouldn't be able to fly it, right, if there wasn't a, a, a leash on it right now. So it, of course, it's very safe. And actually, what you're seeing now, behind me, hopefully, yes, ah, is, is, is the downlink from this thing, so it's a live video. And, and, and you can see it's kind of a flying steady cam, right? And it's pretty neat, because what we, what we actually did is we, we took a complex system, and we kind of started removing components, and see how, how do things still work. And we discovered that in this case, if you add a feather as a mechanical constraint, and remodel the dynamics of the system, you get something pretty cool. You can, the vehicle right now is maintaining the angle relative to me just based on onboard sensors on alone. There's no radio, there's no machine vision, there's no GPS, obviously. And that's it, because it, it's just so simple, it becomes like a flying pet, right? And also, as soon as you have the feather, that's kind of cool to me, I didn't come up with this. People think of it as a pet, so <laughs> it's the last thing I would say. I would say about it, um, but yeah. And um, so, so this is all nice, that nice, right? I'm flying it here, but I could just put the camera there. That's very interesting. Oh, let me show you this trick. You can actually use the physics of this system to play around with. It. So if I wanted to go further, I just extend the feather, and then I can actually use the inertia to pull it back in. <laughs> Alright, so something I like. I like to do. Thank <laughs> you.